There are so many guests already arriving. And have you seen the wedding decorations they put up in the gardens? So beautiful. You know, we're as lucky as she is. Marjorie was but a lady when we were sent to serve at Highgarden. But in just a few days' time, we'll be attending to a queen at a royal feast. Where we're standing, we'll be able to see everyone. And everyone will be able to see us. Sarah, it will be Marjorie's day, not ours. I... I know. I... I didn't mean anything by it. I've been meaning to say... what I told you about my... family. It means a lot to be able to share that with someone. Someone I can trust. If handmaidens don't help each other in King's Landing, nobody will. Thank you, Mira. And you know I'll always help you too. Hold on, look. There he is. Lord Morgren? No, no, next to him. Lord Tarwick. I don't want to be a handmaiden forever. And this wedding may be the best chance of meeting a husband I'll ever have. I have to go talk to him. Marjorie won't notice it for a few minutes longer. Could you make an excuse for me? Please. I'm not asking for much. Are you sure you know what you're doing, Sarah? Marjorie's so busy. I can't just wait for her to find a match for me. Please, just don't tell Marjorie. Ah, oh, damn it. Suppose dirty ass boy. That boy dirty. What are you doing here? I know I shouldn't be here. But we have to talk. I didn't know when I would see you next. Look, that night, I don't know what might have happened if you hadn't helped me. Well, I could say the same to you, Lady Mira. But I came here to warn you. I was down in Flea Bottom last night when I overheard a couple of Lannister guards talking about. Shh! They already know he's missing, probably dead. They're questioning people, searching for his body. It's not safe. Please tell me you took care of it. Of course. I told you I would. No one will know what you did. What? What is it? If we're gonna survive this... What if they find his knife? I threw it away, and there was blood on it. Oh, oh no. You do not want to get caught looking for it. Just don't get in any more trouble. And I'll... I'll watch your back. We're in this together now. You saved my life. I don't even know your name. It's... It's Tom. Thank you, Tom. Don't thank me yet, Lady Mira. There's still a knife out there covered with a dead man's blood. And I don't... Mira! My lady. Really? A tryst in the bushes with that coal boy? Not to say it's wrong, but... With all the lords and knights in King's Landing, you just don't want to spoil your chances of a good marriage. Can we just keep it between us? I prefer nobody knows. Of course. That's what friends do. Mm. Come on. Oh, I did tell Marjorie me. expects us at the throne room. We don't want to be late. You can tell me all about this Lord Tarwick on the way. Well, first of all, his name's Garibald. And he has this really funny accent. He told me the cleverest story about this festival they have where they celebrate. And I've given the musicians a list of songs to play for Joffrey at the feast. I assume you have no problems with the reigns of Castamere? I trust you've chosen all the standards. But just to be sure, I'll draw up a list of wedding ballads we favor in Highgarden. Your Grace, my lady. 
Which reminds me, Joffrey will require his king's guard close at hand during the feast. I'm afraid we'll have no room for your handmaidens. <gasps> but we... What was that? Do you object? Is that what I heard? I, uh... If you're going Your to Grace, speak out of turn, girl, I... you should finish what you start. We do as you command, Your Grace, and we'll spend the feast wherever it pleases you. You'll spend it mopping the stables, if I please. I asked your handmaiden, here at the Iron Throne, whom she would serve if forced to choose between yourself and the king. She was deferential to the crown then, as she is now. But words are wind. You can mop these nuts, In any bitch. case, it's settled. The King's Guard will stay with Joffrey. Your handmaidens will sit elsewhere. Of course, Your Grace. Anything for my beloved Joffrey. Lady Ooh. Marjorie, we may yeah, not see man. eye to eye on everything, but I hope you will at least agree with me that our handmaidens should know their place. And that place is not with my brother, Tyrion. Oh, wow. She knew all about what that. What did she mean by that? You and Tyrion. What you do reflects on me. If something's going on, I need to know about it. Tyrion... He offered to help my family. He did? Then surely he expects something in return. Sarah, what do you know of this? Tyrion approached us, my lady. It was his idea, not Mira's. I don't care what your intentions were, Mira. You went to a Lannister behind my back. I've only ever tried to help you. Why are you making trouble for me? Bitch, you never helped me. Never! My family needs me. We're losing everything. I have to do whatever I can to help them. I'm not blind to your pain, Mira. Yeah, but you your are. problems are not the only ones in the world. Right now, I need you both to be my handmaidens, and that's all I need you to be. I don't like her no more. Let there be no mistake. If I hear of you speaking so much as a word to Tyrion Lannister again, you can go home to your family. I'm sorry, my lady. I made a mistake. It won't happen again. Please don't send me home. This can't happen again. I'm lying my ass off. Sounded like a prison cafeteria, I guess. Roderick, it's the White Hills. They're assembling in the courtyard. They've woken the house. You can't let this go on. They want to see us cower. Don't worry, Tally. I'll deal with them. Hurry, I'll check on Mother. of dead men if I have my way. <laughs> what is the meaning of this? I demand to know. <laughs> Those are strong words. For a cripple who can't carry a sword, all of you, show your respect to Griff Whitehill, fourth-born son of Lord Lud Whitehill and commander of this garrison. 
Cocky Roderick, we used to call you. Swinging your prick round, lording it over my family. Now look at you, hey? Roderick the Ruined. I hardly recognize you, but the name fits, don't it? <laughs> Pathetic. I've had enough of this, Griff. What are you trying to prove here? I had to get your attention, didn't I? Always so busy beating your own chest, Roderick. I don't think he gets it. No, my lord. I don't think he does. Your brother Ethan didn't get it either. You bite your tongue. I am in charge now. And the first thing you need to know is that if I am not happy, no one is happy. So my men are taking over your great hall. That's where we'll quarter from now on. What? You can't. You'll have to go through me. I won't have my men sleeping out in your barn in shit and filth. Maybe that's how foresters live, but not us. I don't care if you're happy or not. You'll quarter where I tell you. I wasn't fucking asking, Roderick. And what's more, you will treat my men right. I've heard what you've done, pushing wine on them, turning them into drunkards. That ends now. I'm not here to keep them in line. I'm here to keep you in line. You think you're being clever? We've given your men the wine they want. If they drink too much of it, that's their doing. Watch yourself, Roderick. This is against the King's law. You've no right to make such demands. I have every right. We're here under the orders of Bruce Bolton, Warden of the North. So I will be in your halls. I will be in your courtyard. I will sit on your fucking council and be in your bedchambers if I bloody well please. You can't do this, Mick. Bastard. You can't just do whatever. We'll do what we were sent here to do. You're here to keep watch on your soldiers. That's all. Don't act as if you're something more. You aren't listening, Roderick. And that's a dangerous fucking habit for a cripple. Now, me and my men will take our place in your hall. Unless you think you and your army can stop me. You damn right. Stab that motherfucker in his face. No. You know better than that. You know where we'll be. This is outrageous. Roderick, you can't let them do this. Yeah, fuck it. You can't go in there. We can and we will. Unless you want this all to end right now. Eh? I'm the only lord here. Come on. Garrison. Trophy?